And we are a true platform company and especially distributional industry. There are a lot of people using platforms. Can the users become personalized and individualization? So personal platform business has started. And this is one and one too many. A new paradigm. Personal platform business for every single individual. Absolute quality and price. We're competing against the big brands, platform business and others. We have GSGS strategy and training system and board system and an absolute quality and price. We're building our competitive edge and competitiveness towards this strategy as well. Absolute quality and price has been very important and this has been proven not just in Korea but in many countries. A lot of people chose Atomy and doing Atomy business because of that. GSGS strategy. Atomy personal platform business and we are using GSGS strategy as you can see on the slide the pictures and the videos is showing the manufacturing process and how we take care of the hygiene category make sure that everything's clean and we call APP business training system and education system and for personal business owners we're doing the education system. We have the E and M, the entertainment category, and through the virtual reality, as you can see, uh, President Park Kangil's character, this is virtual reality. And a lot of people are communicating through online and global one market. If you're a member of Atomy, then you can go to APPB on the screen on the right side. Personal platform creates a lot of value and shares the fruits regardless your background and regardless your nationality as well. The board system. The board system meaning compensation system and this is the magnetic board system. When members use the absolute quality and price products, it creates profit and they also can save a lot of money. We call this magnetic board system. Personal platforms, a lot of people can use this anywhere anytime. Non-members can use this as well. Before that we had we couldn't provide this service but now non-members can use it. AI and big data and also patent and certification we will execute this plan. Then we will create consumer groups by doing that. After login you can order you don't have to log in if you're not a member. So non-member payment is possible. This is APP business. Also, you can promote, advertise new products. And there is an alarm of repurchasing products and also suggesting the products. Personal platform connects every single one of us. It doesn't matter about the time difference. And some of the functions of Atomy personal platform. It doesn't matter of the capital and without technology and every single member can have their own personal platform, which is very important near the future. 
if you are a Tomian and he or she can use it anytime, anywhere, but also you can add individual content. And the platform has no, has no relationship with the followers. It doesn't matter about how many followers that you have. You can advertise on Instagram, on YouTube, or Facebook. And you have to get a lot of followers. However, personal platform is very different from those big platforms. And you grow with the platform and the technology the platform has. And Atomy personal platform, they suggest, recommend new paradigm. And through this platform, owning business, you'll be successful. And every one of us can have a chance. Atomy. Hello everyone. Today is November 25, uh, 2021, and welcome to our Global uh, Top English Seminar. My name is Luke Kim, and I'll be your host to, for you today. Um, before we begin, I would like to say there is um, no translation today. There's no current translation, and we apologize for that, and hopefully we'll be able to have that uh, back next week. So. Let us start off our company uh, seminar by starting with our company motto, and then that will be our official start of today's meeting. So if you can join with me with the company motto by turning on your mic and following the actions that we have as well, that would be very much appreciated. So let us begin. Is everyone ready? Yes. Cherish the spirit. Cherish create the, the vision. spirit. Create the vision. Follow the faith. Follow the faith. Serve in humility. In humility. Aja, 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 aja. 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 All right. Thank you very much for joining me with the company model. Um, and so now we will begin with our uh, speeches. So we have two three-minute speeches today. The first uh, will be our diamond master, Esther. Hi everyone, how are you? <laughs> I'm a Diamond Master from Canada Toronto Top Center. Nice to meet you all and thank you for joining today. Uh, now the world is covered with atomy. Are you agree with that? Yeah, right, 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 yeah. Currently, our team is challenging with the brother line as a group. So. Just wait. <laughs> Just wait. <laughs> so I will soon become the new Sharonos master. So new uh, another masters comes from Sweden and Calgary and the USA. So through this challenge, I realized that how important teamwork really is really is, right? So it is become, becoming a reality. Uh, there is a true global uh, business, this atomy, atomy business. Mm. So um, uh, it is still in progress, so, but I think it will all completely safely. So thank you to all my sponsors and partners and brothers line. So I wish all of you are here to be successful without missing any single one. See you at the top. Aja, aja, aja. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Um, new to be Sharon Rose Master, let's congratulate her for being able to accomplish that with the group effort of her team and the partnership of sponsor. And within Atomy, it's always a cooperative business. We want to work together to succeed together and that is the way we have to go. So our next speaker is our new Diamond Master A from Sweden. Uh. Hello, everyone. How are you, everyone? Yeah, um, I'm Aishwe from Sweden, Cell Master, and soon will become the new Diamond Master. And I want to share about my Diamond Mastership. It was amazing journeys. 
for my group and I learned a lot and um, how to take care of my partner. Yesterday, we all achieved, uh, we all achieved our uh, master chief challenge. So thank you all my sponsor and uh, partner who is be with me in this challenge. And also yeah, last night when we doing the last, you know, put on the last PV and I was talking to Esther like, oh, now I can finally sleep. You know, I have been not sleeping very well. It's late when I come from home from my original work. And then I had to sit here and, and uh, you know, figure out the PV where to put in and Esther have him up. And it was amazing. And uh, we can, if we did in a challenge, so we will never know what is, what is the challenge is, what is to become a master or something like that. So it's thanks to all my sponsor and also Esther who's guiding me in and uh, she also very busy, sometimes so confused with PV, you know. It's very difficult if we didn't uh, know how to do it and match in the PV. And uh, also, first I, first I will actively help all my partner to become a um, auto cell master. And also I, I, I want all my partner also to grow and I want the, I will help and do my best to have them grow and also um, for now and me and my team in Sweden we are creating a new Zoom meeting uh, on Sweden so we are creating our Sweden and UK group meeting this week so in this this uh, Monday we having our first meeting in, in Sweden in Korean language uh, English and also Sweden, we missed a little bit of the language because we are different in, you know, in the group. So, uh, of, of course, finally, my next goal is to become a Sarah master and also I'm still waiting for to open the center in Sweden. And thank you very much everyone for listening and, and see you all at the top. Aja, aja, aja. Thank you very much. Uh, hey. So we hope that you do make it to share Rose Master very quickly as well, and that your team is also able to do extremely well. We, from A's uh, message, we heard that her group is becoming so globalized, different language all coming together to kind of cooperate and do meetings as well. And then having uh, A from Sweden, people from Toronto, Korea, all around the world at to be becomes a globalized business where members all around the world becomes part of your team. You cooperate together. While there is some um, difficulty uh, managing the time difference within each world, yeah, I mean, each <laughs> cities and countries, but with at to be able to still cooperate, work together and still be able to accomplish something that we are all trying to achieve with the same goal and same path. So thank you very much for the three minute speeches. We were able to uh, learn a lot about what is going on here. Now, our next speaker is a uh, product uh, presenter. Uh, he is sales master, David Kim. Hello, my name is David Kim. I am sales master from Toronto Top. And today we'll just be talking about two brief uh, products from Atomy. Uh, the first one today will be uh, Atomy's liquid detergent. Uh, Atomy's liquid detergent is, uh, it costs $18 before tax and has a PP of 4,400. So this Atomy detergent is actually eco-friendly and uh, plant-based. Uh, and it does not contain any of the controversial harmful ingredients that other detergents have. Uh, you actually do not need a lot of the liquid detergent uh, compared to other uh, detergents like Tide or like any other companies. Um, they would put like a lot in for hours. It's very highly concentrated and you only need just like a cap full or like a bit less than usual. Um, it actually washes your clothes very well and it's residue free as well. Uh, Atomy's uh, contains natural soda ash, which uh, is basically it increases the pH level of the water. So it removes the dirt uh, from the fabric uh, a lot easier compared to other detergents. 
Uh, it also has um, a baking soda that neutralizes the acidic dirt from the fatty acids for our clothes. And it also has like plain uh, base uh, surfactant or like extracts from sugarcane, corn, and coconut, which will also in, like dissolve, make uh, help it easier to dissolve in water because like lighter and thinner or like just easier to help. Um, it's also uh, made with pine needle extract. Uh, this is actually very good for people who have sensitive skin or if you have uh, kids or babies, because I know for sure that uh, for newborns, they're actually allergic to a lot of the detergents that, um, that are made. Uh, so you have to find a specific one and they're usually very expensive, but this is, uh, Atomy's detergent is actually pretty cheap for how much you actually use. And uh, a lot of the kids or babies or who have a lot of sensitive skin could actually use this very well because it doesn't irritate the skin or anything like that. It's very light too. and has a very natural scent. Uh, the next one will be our dish detergent. So our dish detergent is $12 before tax and has a PV of 3100. Uh, Atomy's dish detergent is also actually very highly concentrated with our high natural ingredients that we have. Uh, I actually put our this dish detergent in another soap dispenser and I actually mix it with water. Uh, it sounds weird because I would dilute it, but it's actually that strong so that I actually don't need a lot to wash my dishes, fruits, or vegetables. Um, so up to me, dish detergent, actually you're able to wash uh, fruits and vegetables very well. Uh, it is actually classified as a class one dish detergent from Korea's Ministry and Health uh, and Welfare. Uh, so this means that it's the top ingredients and have been approved by the ministry. Uh, it is also safe to use on fruits. I know some people don't like eating their apples or like their vegetables with like it's being all dirty. I know some people actually, uh, when they eat the apples, it's actually like a wax uh, like strip on the apples to keep them from like uh, just, you know, getting a bit older faster. So this actually helps uh, to wash that wax off easily because people actually soak the apple to remove the wax with, I believe, salt water for like 24 hours to remove the wax. But I would just... Uh, soap could actually just uh, remove it very easily just by cleaning it. You could also use it to wash broccoli or strawberries very well, as those are also fruits and vegetables that are hard to clean. Um, I'll use this uh, very often actually for like even giving as a gift, especially when people, um, when they come to new house, you want to give a, a welcome gift uh, to them. I would actually give them either the dish detergent or the laundry detergent because for me, I use that a lot at home. And I feel like when new when people come to their house, that's like usually the first thing they would have to get, but they're too like busy to buy it. So if I like, I'll recommend you guys to try this and to just give it to your friends or family uh, as a little welcoming gift or just to try it out. Yes, thank you for listening. Thank you very much. So it's Master David Kim. Yes, uh, the dish detergent and the laundry are very, extremely concentrated. If you put too much, it becomes very strong. Uh, like you can, you can smell that it's very strong when you kind of spill some of it. Uh, the dish detergent, especially if you spill it on your sink, oh, you're gonna have a long time uh, clean that up because it very, uh, like it foams up a lot. So be careful with that. And please do make sure to try it out because those are our high quality daily necessity items that Atomy has. So thank you very much for the product presentation once again, and let us move on to our lineage strategy marking presentation to understand how to create your lineage so that you don't create any mistakes so that every structure and the teamwork that you create are able to function cooperatively instead of uh, counterintuitively so that you are able to build a strong team and to uh, go up in, in a fast and quick manner. So the speaker today is Diamond Master, new Diamond Master, Daniel Kim. 
Hello, hello. Welcome, everyone. Thank you all for uh, being here. I know some of you, it's very early in the morning or late at night. So once again, I thank you all for being a part of this uh, growing business. And right now, if you're here, uh, I just want you to, you know, pat yourself on the back because you're here for a good reason. You know, this is a, a raising amazing opportunity uh, that you've been given, right? And thankfully, I have this big opportunity to kind of explain how line management works in Atomy, right? So many people are confused or they follow a misleading guide to building their lines, but it's actually quite straightforward, right? And so we're going to go into that and dive a little bit deeper. And so just like this picture we have here, teamwork is the key to building your Atomy business, right? So it's not a big secret at all. We're not hiding the golden goose somewhere in like a locked cage for you to never find, but rather it is out in the open. It's spoken by many leaders, many Imperial Masters, Crown Masters, even your own sponsors day in and day out, that teamwork is the key to building your Atomy business, right? And that is how you're going to succeed in this company with your team. Because by yourself, it is just strictly impossible to get far in this business, right? But with teamwork and with your help of your partners, your sponsors, and even your consumers, you're able to rapidly progress in this so-called platform-based business. And so the lineage, right? Here is a picture of the British monarch lineage. So now let me ask you a question. For a monarch, is it good if they have a deep rooted history and lineage or if it is a short history and lineage? And the answer is very simple, right? It is to have a deep lineage so that they may continue to have a rich and deep history. But it also gives reassurance to the countries and citizens within that country that it's going to be a stable country when the lineage is passed on from one king to another, right? Uh, but if the king's lineage always changes, the people would be worried about the country's future because they don't know what the next king or whoever is going to rule is going to be like. They may be a bad king. They may be a good king. And so the same thing applies to Atomy, right? The deeper your lineage is, the stronger it will be. So it depends on what you do with your lineage. You could either have a strong roots that won't break, or you could have a wide lineage that will shake with just a little breeze. So building a strong lineage is possible because Atomy only allows for two lines to be built per person. So you have to go down that line per person. And so here is a little diagram I have here for you uh, in terms of making deep rooted, rooted lineages. So our goal should be not a tree with just leaves and shallow roots, but a really deep rooted tree with infinite lines so that we won't ever break even if the hardest of storms come to us right so as you can see in the tree to the very left it is very big it looks really big but on the ground inside the soil its roots are tiny and so if a flood comes it's if a tornado comes that tree will be ripped out of the ground and tossed away and so imagine yourself as this tree as an atomian that means that you're only thinking of your own profits or only thus the base profit of what Atomy might be, right? If you're only satisfied with making $2,000 a month, right, $3,000 a month, then you should probably go back to being a stable nine to five job, right? Because this, in the beginning, it might not look like anything, right? Just like that tree in the middle, you'll have no rewards, even sometimes no fruit in some months. But as you continue to work hard, continue to put all your efforts into this, your roots will grow deeper 
and deeper. And then eventually you'll start to see the rewards of your efforts, right? But that is what a lot of people fail to see. They, they only see the outward things and say, oh, you know, I'm not making that much money. Only $60 a, a day or only $60 every week. Oh, this is not a business for me. But for those people, they miss the opportunity to see the bigger picture that Adamy has. Because this business is not something you do just to make $2,000 a month. We're here to make $100,000 a month. Right? And if you can like reassure me and say that there's another job I can do that will also make me $100,000 a month, then please let me know. right? Because I'd like to really know if there's anything like that. But I can guarantee you that there is nothing like that that you can find out in the open market right now. Even if you are a doctor or a lawyer or a technician, the most you can make in a year, not even a month, in a year might be 100000 or a bit more. But Atomy allows for us to make 100000 a month in that kind of opportunity. That is amazing. That is something unheard of in any sort of company. And so the deeper our roots are, the stronger we will be. And so that way, even if the hardest of times come, you'll still be able to produce results. So here are some rules that I want you to kind of have to keep for yourself, right? So in the beginning, many people who first join Anime think that they have to start looking for people to help. But the best way to grow is to succeed yourself and then afterwards help others once you are successful, right? So you don't have to start looking for people right away to you know, help grow because you're not even ready, right? How can you help someone when you're still a baby? Right. In order for you to help someone, you have to be an adult. And in order for to, you to, to do that, you should start applying yourself, studying, learning. Right. And so this is all comes with the Atomy's program, the success systems. And so let's say you have a new partner that joined and they live in another city or a country. They just started, so it is just not practical to fly all the way to where they are just to help that one partner when they haven't even already started doing any of the business full time or making any money. In the beginning, the amount of money you can spend is limited. So you should look for members that are close to where you live, right? It's just simple as that. It's just silly for us to go all the way to another country if that person is not really 100% all in anatomy and been already working hard. Right. If they started showing results and they're doing things like that, then there is no reason why you shouldn't go there to help them out a bit more. But if they've just started, don't place all your bags and the eggs in that person's basket because that is a quick way to you know, feel like you've made a big mistake. Right? So don't, don't fear. There's always going to be people you'll find near you and then those people will lead to more people. And so that is how you want to grow your connection. And so from your connections, you should start to look for leaders that can help grow your business. And then slowly grow your lineage through connections. And after you start to move further out into different cities and eventually globally to other countries, right? Because the reason why you want to do this is once you're grown and with your sponsor's help, it will become easier to grow quickly. But if you start to add people in another country right away, you could face some difficulties as a beginner, right? The same connections, you know, must be signed up in the same, you know, place. That is another big thing that we should also do. So please group your connections together and have them sign up in the same line, right? If they are from the school that you've attended, then make sure they are on the same line. If they are from a family members, do not split them up and put them one side left, one side right, just so you can potentially make money. Keep them in the same line, the same with your coworkers or any other people. If they're in the same group, keep them there. The reason why is because people will fight over each other and will cause your groups to break down. 
right? So there's a sponsor uh, who found someone in, in the Indonesia. So this is a story I heard, and they seemed like great leaders. So they had a lot of potential, these two couples. And so that couple was excited to work. And when the sponsor asked again a month later how they were and how they progressed, they said that they are no longer going to do this business. So what could have happened during that one month? Well, it's very simple. What happened was that the couple went to their church to sign people up. And instead of signing people in the same group, they signed them up in different lines, which caused a major issue. And thus that group can no longer be able to do atomy because everyone is fighting amongst themselves on where they should be. So you must do uh, both legs, right? Atomy is a, a binary system, right? So another big thing is to do both legs, build both legs, no matter whether your sponsor says they will do one leg for you or not, because eventually that can work against you and you will be just hurting your own growth without both lines having your own connections, right? Because even if, if let's say you have one line the sponsor does for you, and so you're only focusing on one line, and then you have to, it comes time for you to challenge for Diamond Master. You have partners on your right leg, but what about on your left leg? The sponsor's partners are not your partners. So if you say, oh, let's go and challenge for it, will they say yes to you? Or would they rather listen to their sponsors? They'd probably listen to their own sponsors than you because you're not really directly related to them. So it's very important for you to have your own people in your own legs because this is all about having two people each on each leg to grow your business, right? Two sales master each, two diamond masters each on each side. And eventually that is how you keep con continuing to grow. But if you don't have anyone there, it's just going to be a very difficult time for you in terms of progressing further into Adam. And so we covered some of the rules that we should keep. How about what are the things that we should watch out for? Right. So let's cover some of those. And so do not, you know, make a lineage for those who are just a customer. This will have a negative impact to your business partners and to your own business. So example of this is you have a son or a daughter who you love. So you add them under you and start to make two lines under them because you want them to make money, even though they're not interested in doing the business at all. This will have a significantly negative impact on your partners because you are creating an unfair advantage to those who are working hard and humans naturally do not like to be in an unfair situation. Once they realize you are only helping your sons, daughters grow quickly, they'll feel like it is a broken system and no matter how hard they try or they work, they will not be getting a properly good support that they need. And then eventually your lines will go sideways instead of down and cause your business to fail, right? So this is a big, big factor that a lot of people make mistakes of. And I think that many people fall into this trap because they want to help their family. They love their family. Who wouldn't, right? You love your sisters. You love your brothers. You love your sons and daughters. And so you want them to succeed. But that is not the best way to help them in this business, right? If you're doing this, then you're only ruining everyone's opportunity, including your sons and daughters. So please be wary of this. And in the beginning, please consult with your sponsors on where to add your consumers and partners, right? This is a very, very big thing. Always consult with your sponsors as a beginner, right? Because many people think that, oh, I know everything now and they're just going to add randomly but that is not how this business works, right? Your sponsors are already successful. Why not already take the information that they've already gone through to apply into your own business? So this person here in this picture was advised to do two lines, but they firmly believed that they had to do a pyramid-like structure because they already did MLM business before. They've had experience before. And so they said, oh, I don't need to follow this guy. He doesn't know anything. And they just went and built their own pyramid just like this, right? This person did not even last six months before quitting, right? 
this person wasn't able to make any partners or royal customers and ended up you know, having their business closed. So why does this structure fail? Right? The answer to that is that you being at the top, there's a limit to how much you can do for your lines by yourself because you're supposed to send points down on either of your left or right main lines. But what about those people in between that you've added? You can't focus on any specific one line because each, each side needs help. Each line needs help because you've added them all, right? So please avoid doing this matrix lineage with you being at the top going from one, two, four, eight, 16. You will 100% fail this business. This is not a pyramid style business. You're just going linear. It's very simple, two legs, only two legs, right? And all you have to do is continuously follow two legs. It's not always going to be so, you know, cut to the cloth simple like that. Sometimes you have to move your legs according to where your partners are working. But in the very basics of Atomy, it is always going to be a binary system. Because in the end, you have to help those legs. And if you suddenly have eight legs to help, how are you going to help it? You only have limited money limited time and resource, you can't help them all. So in order for you to maximize your time and money, you have to make sure you're only doing two legs. And the one person who wants you to succeed the most is your sponsor, right? Why? Because if the sponsors help you succeed, then they'll also succeed. So they have no reason to lose out on, right? The, that is why the sponsors you know, if they have to be the ones that tend the system as well. These sponsors are the ones that love the products and do the business, not the person who signed you up. Because if they don't, if they signed you up and they don't care about Atomy, they just signed you up so that, you know, quote unquote, they make money, then that's not a sponsor. The proper sponsor is someone who's been properly integrated into the system, loves the products, does the business, helps support you if you need help or ask when you ask questions those are the kind of sponsors that you want to look for so please be plugged into the system and continuously ask your sponsors questions because that is what they are there for and so now i'm going to kind of get into the deeper uh, structures of building lineage right so there's going to be a few different pictures and examples and so I, I want to kind of break it down on different things that people have done before and how you should avoid and build the proper lines. And so this example is that we are building only one line. So I remember I mentioned earlier that, oh, we have the sponsor saying, oh, you don't have to worry, just, you know, do one leg, I'll do the other, right? And this is where the big problem comes in. So here you are at the very top. Me is yourself. And then you have Mr. Kim as a business partner. And so you tell Mr. Kim, he can just work on his right leg. And then you'll focus on his left. And how easy is that, right? No other thing. It's just a linear system that, but does it look easy? And in the beginning, it might seem that way. Because you made a promise to Mr. Kim, you also have to keep doing that and add people on his left side. But as I focus or as you focus on Mr. Kim's left side, you need to start growing your other side, right? Because that side is already pretty big now, right? And so you need to start focusing on your other side so that you can also grow your own business. Now, this person uh, on the left side, uh, Mr. Kim, none of those people are, are his own partners and members. So he can't do any sponsor activity on that side of that line because he doesn't know anyone. And this person appears with both legs grown. And so that person doesn't even work, but now they are able to get money. So you see here, this is a pig, right? We Here in Atomy, we call them pigs. Right, this person here in the, the right beside Mr. Kim is on the left side, is not even doing any work, and he's already starting to get money. And this line will now become a complete mess because Mr. Lee appeared right here. 
right? Mr. Lee is your partner. He is my partner. He wants to do business. But because the sponsors above him is not working and Mr. Kim is not his sponsor, they will come to me instead. But the problem is I can't help them because I'm already busy growing my own two legs. So you must always keep in mind to do both legs because whose business is this? This is your business, right? No one else, your own business. And so as here, you can see Mr. Lee came and then he wants to do business, but I can't help him at all. And it's become a very, very tough situation because Mr. Kim won't help him. And then the person who's just becoming a pig won't help him. Then eventually Mr. Lee will leave and it won't help the person who is at, you know, benefiting from that or Mr. Kim or myself. So all you're doing is hurting your own business by doing this. So please do not tell your partners that you're only you're going to build one leg, leg for them. This is a binary system. Everyone does their own two legs, right? Don't rely on your sponsors to, you know, put in people or put in points for you. Do your own work and eventually the people will follow, the sponsors will follow, and that is how it works, right? But if you don't do anything, nothing will come of it. So please make sure you do that. And so there's another example here. So problem with adding members into non-partner lines, right? So what does that mean? So now we have this scenario. And so the customer is someone you know, like your sibling or your child, and they do not work in this business, sir. And you care about them and want them to make money. So you start to add members down their right leg. So you see right there, M2, M3, M4, M5. So then now what would Mr. Kim think? He probably will feel angry, right? If you were Mr. Kim, would you not feel angry or upset? Because Mr. Kim is working hard doing both legs. He's put some people on his right. He's put some people on his left. But the person right above him doesn't even help him because they're not interested in doing this business, but then they're making money off of Mr. Kim's hard work. And his own sponsors, which are you, instead of building up the people that are actually doing this business, he's focused on building up his family. So in the views of Mr. Kim and Mr. Lee, this is not a fair system. And this will cause the partners to dislike their sponsors. And this lineage will either grow really slowly or eventually those Mr. Kim and Lee will leave, causing your business to collapse, right? So make sure you start thinking about what kind of things you're doing when you're helping other people that is not going to be doing this business. You're not benefiting anyone by doing that. If you really want to help those uh, you know, customers, then do that after you are really big and rich. Right. Once you're Imperial Master, you can help whoever you want right? while helping your main line. But until then, don't focus on another person's line because you're not helping anyone. You're just wasting your own time and money by doing that. And so what should you do? Right? Build your line like this. Right? So by adding all your own people under one line, this is how you build a strong, deep-rooted line. Instead of having a messy, all-around line, I've been building straight down, and that is what you want to do, right? Because in Atomy, you can go to the very bottom to add points because everyone benefits. So it allows for the line to continuously get deeper and deeper if everyone in your group follows this diagram, right? Mr. Kim's going to continue to add more people on his left, which is also your right leg. And then he's also going to add more people on his right. And then that's just going to continuously grow your business. And you're also going to continuously grow Mr. Kim's business in return because you're creating this strong lineage and deep-rooted body. Right? And so in this diagram, now Mr. Kim and Mr. Lee will feel like this is a fair system and will work even harder to grow their lines. Right? Because they realize that their sponsor is helping them. Their sponsor is supporting them. And so that they feel even more obligated to want to do harder, do work harder, because they want to succeed. This is their business. 
right? And so with a little bit of push, people can work hard. And so next thing is to make a deep rooted line, right? Here's another example. You're working hard, following your lines. And now you have the two new partners, right? Mr. Kim and Mr. Lee. And, and they come to you and ask you to put people under you because they have no one that they know, right? And so you're like really nice, you're generous. So you're like, okay, I will do that. And so you add Mr. Kim, his person on the right, the M4. And same with Mr. Lee, you add M3, right? But the people I've added are all my own customers and partners, not Mr. Lee's, not Mr. Kim's partners. So in the end, who has to help them? Right? Who has to give them sponsor points and things like that when they ask for assistance if they want to do business? You have to be the one to take care of them because it's your partner. It's not Mr. Kim's. It's not Mr. Lee's. You listen to your partner's cries for help, and now you've made yourself an even more headache. Right? And you're not helping anyone. At the end of the day, you're just making it very harder for you to succeed in this business. So take care of only one leg because you only have a limited amount of money and resource. You know, most people who have all done business, we all know that money is important. That's how it works, right? The amount of money you spend equates to expenses, equates to revenue and income. And, you know, if minus your income plus your expenses is what you make, your net profit, right? But if you have more expenses than income, then you're going to be in the negative. So it's very important for us to, you know, think like businessmen and women to plan ahead and make sure we're not excessively overspending on things that shouldn't be spent on. So what should you do then? So what should you do? Very simple. We've been talking about it since the very beginning of this seminar. Make deep rooted lines. Build it like this image on the right. So you have your main line, Mr. Kim and Mr. Lee's left leg is your main line. So you continue to build that line, no matter what they say, even if they continue to ask you, right? Because that is what you need to do to help them. You're not helping them by adding more people on their right legs, right? In the end, you're just causing everyone to fail. Your sponsors, when they put points into you, during a challenge or anything, those are fake points. They're not your own points. So don't rely on those points and those members, right? Take advantage of doing your own business, finding people. There's going to be, be people that's going to always complain to you. You know, I don't have people. I don't know anyone. But you don't have to know a lot of people to do this business. You just need to know a few right? Because that's how you multiply. Let's say I only know five people, right? I'd say a majority of you here know at least five people you can contact. Contact those five people. Ask them, introduce Atomy to them, right? And then ask those five people to introduce you five more, right? So we went from five people to 25 people additionally, because each person introduces five person each to you, right? So that is how this word of mouth connections lineage business works. In the beginning, you only have five people by yourself, but you, know, you add your aunt. Your aunt knows five people at least. They'll introduce you to those five people. Now you have five more people. And then you have your best friend. Your best friend knows at least five people. And then they'll invite five more people, right? And you don't have to be shy or worried because we're not introducing them something bad or negative. Because if you think that Atomy is something to be shy or embarrassed about, then you're probably doing the wrong business, right? So invest your time Please attend these seminars because you will learn a lot, right? We are always talking about something new, always trying to help our members to 
properly go down the right way so that they can succeed. Because we want everyone here to succeed, everyone here to be millionaires and be at the top. And so I hope everyone learned a little bit of something on how to build line management today. And I just want to thank everyone here for listening and see you all at the top. Thank you so much. Thank you very much for that amazing presentation. Um, yes, whenever we are making or assigning people up, it's good to communicate with your sponsor to understand what is a good layout. Because sometimes what we may think might be the right path to take or what place to create may not be actually the best option. Sometimes the most prosperous uh, path to take is when we are the most selfless. To so not prioritize our benefit, but then prioritize the benefit of the members underneath us and to be able to cooperate with them and have them have the best opportunity of success is the best way to go. So yes, it's good to create the lineage correctly and be able to work with your sponsors on how to best manage that uh, lineage layout. So thank you very much once again. And our last speaker for today, a leader message from Shara's master, Young Soo Kim, all the way from Korea. Oh, hello everyone. Good afternoon. Good evening. My name is Yang Soo Kim, Sharon Ojimasta from Canada, Toronto town. So, did you listen well to the information about Adam today? Wow. Oh. I hear it is something I can do right. Yes, see it? We have consumed every single day since we were born and we will continue to consume it until we die. The consumption and shopping we have done with our thinking has been filling the pockets of the rich purse. Now, through Adami, I have been the subject of consumption and the owner of the consumer movement since 10 years ago. Even if you lock a scratch, even you don't have money, you can see many people changed their life coming rich and success through the tool called Adami. I was also an ordinary housewife who raised four children. I just changed the daily necessities that I had to use anywhere. Suggest to other and did consumer companies. Aren't I so successful? Among the many students who are with me today, I am rolling towards success by actually participating in the consumer movement who know the value of Adami and is writing a new history in network market as first class company, right? Adami will grow into first class distribution. Company with sales of 100 to abolish one. Now you have heard about Adami which served Consumers as CEOs working for the success of consumer. This kind of company never been and will never exist again. You are blessed. We are blessed. Don't be a fool to bury this blessed. 
don't throw away this chance on the ground or let it be anywhere, this chance. Let it be taken away, but become a wise owner of enemy that fell 30, 60, 100 times that the fruits. See you at the top. Thank you. Thank you very much, Sharon's Pastor, for that warm message. And so now we have come to our end of our meeting. Thank you all for joining us and for those of you who are on the other side of the world for attending us, attending with us here today as well. So um, I believe we'll do this after. So if you can stay with us uh, until after the meeting for uh, kind of a video session, there's something that I would like to announce and hopefully you can take a part in. So for now, we'll close the meeting with our company model and then we'll do the thing, the activity that I have planned and then take a picture and that'll be the end of our meeting. So if I can get the company model out first, that'll be very much appreciated. Okay, so once again, if you can turn on your mic and join me with the company model, that'd be very much appreciated. So I'll give some time and then we'll begin. So is everyone ready? Yes. Let us begin. Cherish the spirit. Great division. All the faith. Serve in humility. Okay, thank you very much. Officially our meeting is over. But then uh, if we can all do this as a group, this would be very much appreciated. So at to me Canada here, uh, we are in Canada. They wanted um, our center or a lot of the centers here in the Canadian area to create a, a holiday new year message from uh, the centers. So if be very much, uh, I'll be very thankful if you can join me in that message and uh, say some kind of quick uh, message to add to me Canada. That would be, mm, that'd be very much appreciated. So the line is very simple. It'll be maybe, it'll be just uh, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year add to me Canada. And then if we can do that all at once, that would, it may be a little bit tricky, but if we can do that all at once with our mics on, that would be that would be that'd be great. So we'll, I'll say one, two, three, and then everyone can say Merry Christmas, uh, Merry Christmas and a happy new year at to me, Canada, and then wave your hands around. <laughs> that think that would be the uh, greatest. Can I give you a sample? <laughs> Yeah, you can say that. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, Atomic Canada. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> okay. Because I'm going to say 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 I'm 하나, 둘, 셋, 영어로 one, two, three 할 때, uh, Happy New Year, Merry Christmas, at me Canada를 uh, 말해주소, 그 다음에. Um, look, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year 이잖아. 네, Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas, Happy New Year, at me Canada 해서, 그 다음에 손을 uh, 드리, uh, 